everybody! Welcome to Patty's Polish Corner. Today I have a She Modern video and it's a uh, red, white, and blue um, with the stars. Getting set a little early with the 4th of July and I did purchase um, quite a few stars. So hopefully I'll have some more um, good ideas to work with the She Modern stars. And just so you know, I usually do about one to two um, She Modern videos a week. A little bit, you know, more like two a week around the times of my giveaways because Tina sponsors those. So that's really nice of her to um, do that for me. So um, in order for that to happen, I do more videos for her. I love the product. Um, it's easy to use. It is really fun. And I hope you're getting some good ideas um, from the videos and, you know, some nail art ideas as well. So let's, let's get started. Oh, I did have a little bit of struggling in this video. <laughs> um, and I hope you guys can laugh about it because I did. <laughs> anyway, so let's get started. Okay, so today we're going to work with um, the she modeler, she modern, and this is the foil art. It's not the um, water decals. And I've got a bunch of stars here, and then we've got a mixing canvas, and I have some cute red birds. One is a bonus. I like looking at those little bonuses. Okay, so we'll just. Slide these out, and I'm going to use some large stars and some medium sized stars. I have a couple of stampers, um, just some inexpensive ones from eBay, and they're upside down so it's flat. So I'm just going to um, cut off some of the stars and lay them on the stamper head. And then I've got a couple more here. We'll lay them over here. Okay, so um, what I'm going to do now is I have some unt, and Tina does a lot of experimenting with these to get, you know, the right, um, I don't know, the right procedures to um, make these work really well. And so right now, we're going to try the latest one she has. So we're going to drop um, some unt in the center, and this will hopefully, um, you know, Stop any of the foil art from bleeding. What I'm doing is I'm just covering the edge of the, the foil with unt to protect it. Okay, you just want to try to stay inside or right on the edge, but you want to get the whole thing. So I'm just going to do this to all of them and then we'll come back. The next thing we're going to do is we're going to do the same thing, only we're going to use Insta-Dry. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a drop inside the star and one outside the star and to the actual stamping head. And this is a trick that I learned from um, Nails of Interest. So we're just going to cover the outline of the star with the Insta-Dry. You have to kind of work fast because this does dry within like a minute. <laughs> If you wanted to, you could probably use a slower drying polish, and then we're going to connect it to the little handle we just made. Okay, 
and I'm just going to do that with the rest of the stars and then we'll come back. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to decorate the insides of the stars um, with dots, polka dots, and some with stripes. So for the polka dots, I'm going to use a blue Sharpie. And I'm just going to color some random polka dots in the inside of the star. And this is an idea I got on the, from um, one of Tina's videos. And I just loved, <laughs> I loved it so much I knew I had to do it. So that's what I'm doing. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to use this stencil to make some glittery stripes. And I'm just going to put that onto the stamper. And then I'm going to take, I have red hollow. I'm just going to take some red hollow and I'm just going to fill in the stripes. I'm just going to press it down with my finger, kind of put my finger over the rest of it, kind of push it away a little bit. And then I'm going to go over the glitter with some um, some foil glue I'm just going to wipe off the brush in between going over each spot so that I don't get the glitter back in the bottle And I'm just going to lift this up and wait for that to dry. And while we're waiting for that to dry, I'm going to apply the big blue. I think the big blue is perfect color for red, white, and blue Manny. I'm going to apply the second coat. Okay, while we're um, waiting for the stripes to dry, I'm going to use um, a touch of a little water-based top coat. To seal in the Sharpie so that it won't bleed. Okay, so over the blue ones, I'm just going to put a little bit of white polish. on the back of the star. Yeah, there we go. 
I'm going to do that to the other one. Okay, now I'm going to add the stripes to this one. That works out pretty good. So I'm just going to put the star on top of the stripe like that. Oops. <laughs> and then pull it up. Okay, these stripes were obviously too close together. There we go. Oops. I still have that one. I can't get it off my finger. That one's upside down. All right, well, I'm just going to make another stripe and um, put, put the stripes on like that. Actually, I think that looks okay with two stripes. <laughs> but that's how I'm going to put the stripes on the stars. And I'm going to back this star with some white polish as well. There we go. I'll just wait for all of this to dry and stick them on my nails. I decided since these stripes were much smaller, I mean, these stars were much smaller, I'm just going to color the stripes in with Sharpie. And then I'm just gonna back them with white like I did the other ones. So I'm going to have to remove the star from this um, film that it's on to be able to clip away the edges of the um, the glitter that's sticking over the edges. So I'm just going to trim away anything that's hanging over the edge. Okay, there we go. So now I'm just going to return this to the stamper head, put a little nail glue on the back, and when that's dry, we'll be ready to put it on my nails. Okay, so I took the um, tacky layer off of the polish, and now I'm going to apply the stars. I'm going to start with this one, and I kind of want it part on and part off. So I'll just take um, scissors and I will trim off 
these couple little points that are hanging off. Okay, and on this finger, I'm just going to actually that little point for some reason didn't turn out. So I'm just going to put it over here like this. There we go. And I'll trim off the excess with a pair of scissors. Okay, and for the rest of these little stars, I'm just going to put them on. I think I might have forgotten to put... I don't know, I guess I forgot to put the uh, glue on. Okay, so I'm going to put the rest of these little stars on my other fingers. Okay, so now I am just going to add the top coat to all of my nails and I'll come right back and we'll take a look at the final design. So here is the finished look. I hope you liked the video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not one of my subscribers, please subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye for now.